25 keyboard shortcuts you should be using. If you're new to the channel, please hit the red subscribe button below for more Fact Queen videos. Number 25. Control Alt Downward Arrow. If you're looking to prank a friend, this combination of keys is perfect. This keyboard secret rotates your computer monitor at a 180 degree angle. Imagine someone logging into their laptop or computer and seeing their computer screen images completely upside down. It would be hilarious. The catch is that this key combination only works with computers that are running on Intel chipsets, so it won't work on some computers. Give it a try and let us know what happens. Number 24. Control F4. This is one of the most useful key command combinations around. Just by pressing Control F4, you can instantly close the application you are working on. Although it's quite useful, be aware that it can also get annoying if someone else does it on your PC. Payback pranks could put the joke on you. Number 23. Windows Key M Do you need your privacy? The Windows Key M key combo allows you to be stealthy. This command is very useful, but a bit more advanced than the Control F4 combo. By using this one, you can minimize all your programs and applications in the blink of an eye. It can be quite useful if you're working on something private in a public place, or if you have nosy roommates. Number 22. Control H Control H is a great shortcut if you're trying to access the task manager on your computer. This cool move instantly pops the task manager up on your screen. This shortcut will work on almost all Windows versions, however, in Windows 10, it can be used to open the Find and Replace menu on Microsoft Word. Number 21. Click and Shake This one is not actually a keyboard shortcut. Instead, it's a cool mouse maneuver. If you have multiple windows open, just click and hold on to your active program and start shaking it. This will minimize all the other background applications and open pages. And just do the same move if you want to maximize them again. This is a cool, quick shortcut when the roommate is snooping over your shoulder. Number 20. Windows Tab Sure, many of us already know about Alt-Tab combo to toggle between applications, but you may not know about using the Windows Key Tab. This key combination is a cooler way to toggle between your active Windows applications. Number 19. Windows plus Control plus D This is another stealthy new feature introduced by Microsoft. By pressing Windows plus Control plus D, you can create a new virtual desktop. This can also be pretty useful if you're working on something private when there are people around. Simply use this key combo to hide your work by creating a virtual desktop. Or you can work on multiple things simultaneously with two desktops. Just keep in mind, since this feature is newer, it only works on Windows 10. Number 18. Windows plus Control plus arrow key right or left. After you've created a virtual desktop, you can use this key combination to toggle between your desktops. Just a reminder that this feature only works on Windows 10. Like we mentioned before, this can be useful if you're working on something private. To close a virtual desktop, simply press Windows plus Control plus F4, and it will instantly shut down the second desktop. Number 17. Control and Drag there are many ways to copy a file, and most of us already know about Control-C. But this shortcut can be more useful if you like keeping your hand on your mouse, or have to copy large amounts of text. You simply click on a file or first letter of text while pressing Control, then drag a file to the desired destination folder. This is one of the easiest ways to copy a file. Number 16. Control plus Backspace most of us know what a hassle it can be to delete one or several sentences if you're using the backspace key. And if you press it too long, you might end up deleting half your work before it stops. Sure, you can highlight and delete words, but there's an easier way to delete one word at a time. Simply press Control plus backspace and it deletes one word at a time, which is a much faster and more efficient way to go. Number 15. Windows Key plus G The Windows Key plus G combo has different results for different versions of Windows. For example, if you use it on Windows 7 and Vista, 
it will pop up all the gadgets onto your desktop that are actively running in the background. And if you use this handy feature on Windows 10, it will bring up the game bar. Number 14. Windows Key Plus L If you're in a hurry and want to close all applications and log off your PC quickly, hit Windows Key Plus L to close up shop in a flash. This is another slick Microsoft shortcut combo for Windows for logging off the current user. Number 13. Control Plus F Control Plus F is a seriously great shortcut. If you need to find particular words or texts, especially if the words are buried in lengthy, dry material, you can use it in just about any document to search single words, phrases, or entire sentences. Hitting Control plus F brings up a magical find bar. Simply type your desired word, and the shortcut will locate and highlight all the results. Number 12. Control plus Click Control plus click does the trick. Use it when you need to select multiple pieces of information, files, etc. that are not located right next to each other. Without this key and mouse shortcut, it can be a real hassle if you want to select multiple items or files and had to do it one at a time. Number 11. Windows key plus F Another useful command is the combination of Windows key plus F key, which has different results in different versions of Windows. If you use this combo in Windows 8 or 8.1, it will open the search bar to search for files or applications on your computer. And if you use the same key on Windows 10, it opens the Microsoft Feedback Hub, where you can send your feedback and report issues to their service center. Number 10. Alt plus Spacebar Have you ever struggled to find the menu in most of the Windows applications, especially right after a Microsoft Office update? Well, put your mind to rest. Alt plus Spacebar is an easy solution to this problem. To open the menu on any application, simply use this key combination on your keyboard. It will open the menu. No more struggling to find what you're looking for. Number 9. Windows Key plus Shift plus M We have already discussed multiple ways of minimizing all or most of the computer's applications. But what do you do when you have to get all the current applications or windows to maximize? Well, there's a Windows shortcut command for that too. By pressing Windows key plus Shift plus M simultaneously, you can maximize all the current active windows at once. Number 8. Control plus Tab and Control plus N If you use Google Chrome, you're probably used to keeping multiple tabs open. If done one at a time, toggling between multiple open tabs can be tedious, but the Control plus Tab command can do that for you very easily. Simply press this key combination and toggle between all your tabs. And if you want to open a new tab, press Control plus N and it will pop open a new tab on your browser. These combinations work on several versions of Windows. Number 7. Control plus S Holding Control and hitting S is one of the easiest ways to save any document, file, or even a web page to your computer. Simply use this key command combo of Control plus S to save most web pages and all files. It works on almost all versions of Windows. Instead of going to the menu and saving the file manually, this is yet another shortcut time saver in your tool bag of tricks. Number 6. Windows Key plus Any Number if you have multiple apps pinned to your taskbar and you want to open any or all of them, hit the Windows key and any number. Simply by pressing the Windows key plus the number corresponding to the location of that application on the taskbar, you can open that app, all without the hassle of lifting your hand off the keyboard, moving the mouse, and clicking on the application you want to open. Number 5. Windows plus C, Windows plus S one of the newer features that Microsoft has introduced is Cortana, your computer's virtual assistant. Cortana is very useful and has made using your PCs more fun and easy to explore. You can either call upon Cortana by simply saying, Hey, Cortana! Or bust out this shortcut to access Cortana in listening mode. Simply by pressing Windows key plus C, you can summon Cortana in listening mode. Or you can make her appear in text mode by using the Windows key plus S. Number 4. Control plus Shift plus T Control plus Shift plus T to the rescue! 
Have you ever been in the middle of checking out something cool on a browser tab? Or been snooping around on your sibling's computer and accidentally closed the browser by hitting the wrong tab? That's frustrating business. But don't panic. You can redeem yourself without having to start the search engine over again. Simply by pressing Control plus Shift plus T at the same time, you can open the most recent tab you closed. By hitting it again and again, you can also reopen more tabs in the order for which they were closed. Number 3. Control plus D Have you come across an interesting website or page and you get the urge to bookmark it for future visits? Only to go through the tedious steps of finding the bookmark icon and saving the page manually. Well, so have we, but Control plus D is the quick solution. Simply by pressing these two keys simultaneously, you can bookmark any page you are currently on with ease. Number 2. Spacebar Shift plus Spacebar The Spacebar Speed Control shortcut is a real time saver. When you're reading an article that is pages and pages long, scrolling up and down with your mouse or the page keys wastes time by using extra hand movements. Instead, by pressing the spacebar key, you can scroll one page length down at a time. And if you pressed it by mistake or blew past your intended section by pressing it too many times, simply press shift key plus spacebar to go back to where you originally were. Number 1. JK for Facebook. Most everyone on the planet, and maybe beyond, use social media websites like Facebook. One of the most annoying things is if you're watching something on the news feed and the page gets refreshed. To avoid the torturous hassle of scrolling indefinitely to find it again, use the keys J and K. To move on to the next article, use the J key. And pressing the K key will take you back one article as well. Another quick trick is to hit the L key for a quick way to like someone's post. Please hit like, click subscribe, and comment below if you'd like to help us grow and bring more Fact Queen content. Thanks for watching.